am getting ready for the day. Today is basically going to be a Rudolph episode. It's a Rudolph vlog because he's going to have his first bath today and um, there's a few other things. So I've been kicked out of my beauty room because I have some builders who came to do some work that I completely forgot that they were doing. They're fixing my windows and fixing some of the shelves and stuff. So I'm doing my makeup. <laughs> really doing some work so yeah have to do my makeup on the kitchen table Rudolph, my dear the forecast ain't clear so will you please light my way and leave this old man slay So we're in Snappy Snaps and I'm having this photo restored of my mama for Christmas. She doesn't know yet, but this is what Rooney's dad did this. And I'm gonna have it retouched here and blow it up. I think he did a pretty good job. He's just gonna touch it up for me and then get it a little bit bigger maybe in this size. And then gonna give it to her as a present. Oh no, they closed, they went on a walk. Nee. Come on then, come, come on. They're closed, Baba. You can't go today. Come, let's go, let's go. I know. Unfortunately, Rudolph's groomers was closed, so I'm not going to be able to get him done today. Even though I went to another one, they said that they had to have an appointment, so I won't be able to get him groomed today. So I'll have to do it. Another time. Hey, it's a new night, new day, new whatever you want to call it. Good morning, good afternoon, good day, good evening to you, whatever time it is. Um, so basically, I was supposed to take Rudolph to the groomers yesterday, right? But I couldn't because they were closed. I tried to find a new one and um, yeah, just just disaster. So I left that and I thought, oh, I'll do it next week. But he shat in his crate tonight. So ha -ha, I have to give him a bath so you guys can join me in Rudolph's first bath. And you can see how I'm going to clean him basically. I've given him like um, like cleanups before and I've also given him puppy sprays, you know the deodorizers, but he needs a full blown bath because he rolled around in it, it's everywhere and yeah. So we're gonna do that today. <sighs> Come on. So I gave Rudolph a quick once over and he doesn't look as dirty as I thought he would from rolling around in his poo, but he does smell so the bath is necessary. This is a tub that I use for the dog because obviously he's full of poop, he has poopy germs and I don't want that all over my bath. So I rinse him out in this tub first. There's water up to his ankles in there, it's nice and warm for him so he won't feel cold. All the literature that I've read on giving a dog a bath, especially when they are small, is to do it quickly. I used to have a German Shepherd when I was little and it would take forever to wash him because he was so big and had so much fur. But Rudolph's really quick and painless. Rudolphs don't have fur, they have hair. That makes them hypoallergenic. And I rinse him off with some clean water from the shower head, making sure that I don't put the shower head on his head. I just rinse that off with my hands. I rinse off his head with my hands. And then I quickly towel dry him because he's shivering. <laughs> you look like a little rat. Mm. Okay, should we get a blow dry him now? As soon as I let him down, he starts to run up and down the house to stop himself from shivering and he's Six. already started to dry off on his own. He dries really quickly. When he goes out in the rain and stuff, he dries really, really fast. So I set my blow dryer to medium so it's not too hot and keep it a good distance away from him. And I set the power on high. I make sure that he's fully dry when I'm finished blow drying him, especially under his neck and behind his ears. Because if you leave them wet there, their hair can knock and they can also get a skin infection, a rash, all sorts of things. So you want to make sure that your dog is completely dry. All right, all right. Shh, shh, shh. After he's blow dried, I then brush him and fluff him out. And I give him some treats all the way through for being a good boy. The blow drying part is Rudolph's absolute favorite part because I normally blow dry him when I deodorize him and I brush him out and he gets lots of treats. And he likes the feeling of the brush going through his hair. He lies down and takes it all in. <laughs> Yeah, all done. Good boy. Yeah, good boy. Okay, 
Now I just gotta fluff you one last time and then you're done. Good boy. Yeah, you like getting pampered, don't you? You like getting brushed because after every brush you get a trick. Yeah. After every brush you get a bribe. Yeah. Puppy, he's green. Aren't you, boy? Yeah? You still smell like puppy. Look how big he's gotten now. She gave dinner. Yes. Okay, dinner time? Dinner time. So he's supposed to have 20 grams, but I don't measure it because I think I'm a pro at giving him the right amount of food. I think that's 20. So I just eyeball it. So, zero that. Boom, 20 grams. I'm a G, I am a pro at this. 20 grams of food. It used to be his bowl, but now I've given him bigger bowls to feed from and raise them off the ground so that he doesn't get that little gaggy thing that he does. But the food looks like nothing in this bowl. <laughs> okay. He used to be afraid of it, but now he's okay, so. Go for it, dude. Okay. That's it, that's it, that's it. I'm gonna end the vlog. I'm tired, I'm done. See you guys in another one. I hope you enjoyed. Cheers.